Alright, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can get the new Halloween currency called Molas Fast. So, currently you need this currency to actually unlock all of the Halloween items. And, um, yeah, there is quite a lot. So, currently, if I actually added these up correctly, you would need 33,450 Molas to get every item in this update. So, that is quite a lot of Molas. If we come over to the contracts over here, this is how you can actually get the Molas. And they've actually increased how many Molas you get, which is quite sick. Before, this used to be quite a lot less, but now it seems they have actually buffed this, so that's pretty good. What is not good is I spent all of my books when they... We're not buffed, so yeah, I missed out on that one, didn't I? So to get all of the items using only contracts, you would need around 360,000 battle books. Now that is a considerably large amount. The contracts are only here just to help you out. The main way you will actually get these maulers is by getting kills and headshot kills. So if I load into this randomizer game quickly and we try and get some headshot kills quickly. Okay, that was not a headshot. That was not a headshot as well. Right, there we go, we got a headshot kill. You actually get two maulers per kill and four maulers per headshot kill. Okay, just like that, we got a few more maulers. So if we take the original sum and we divide that by four, that is around 9,000 to 10,000 kills. And that is purely headshot kills and you're not gonna hit a headshot every time you get a kill. So being realistic, it'll probably take you about 13 to 14,000 kills to get all of the maulers required. And then if you use the contracts on top of that, you know, you'll get there in no time if you grind the game quite a lot. Some tips I would give is to buy every single contract that you can, except the Lethal Heights contract. I don't buy Stinky Sewers either because I don't really play Street Corner. And that's in the sewers and, and not a lot of people actually go in the sewers. And finally, Airtime. Do not buy this one. This one is not worth it at all to do. I would only recommend buying these ones if you have completed all the other contracts within the contract renewal timer. But yeah, I just think they're a waste of books really and they don't really get done that much so I just avoid them. And finally, if you have not completed the treasure hunt, please go complete the treasure hunt as it gives quite a lot of maulers. I think it's around 1,200 maulers it gives you. Yeah, that is a very nice boost at the start when you start to grind. And also try and play these maps quite a lot because you can still get the 50 molars from actually collecting the treasures even though you've already done the uh, the full treasure hunt. Okay, so now I'm going to play for around 15 to 20 minutes to see how many molars I can actually accumulate in that time. Currently I have 48 molars and decent amount of contracts to be complete. Nice headshot. Hey, you've got him. Wow, you blew his brains out. Nice. Good shot, mate. You've got his head. Right. Um, are you not dead, sir? Very Thank you very much. Shot, oh, we just head. got the witches thing as well. Very Yo, we are absolutely popping off the minute. Come on, bro. Yep, you're dead. You should be getting big maulers. Okay, we've completed a contract wow. right there. Very wow. you blew his okay, this is my first gun. game on, so sorry if my aim's bad. I also recommend using the server browser to actually get on the maps that you need to get the maulers. So right there, I've just went on Villa and put it on Legacy Comp, because that's the easiest way to get headshots in my opinion. Dead upon shots. That is my teammates. Okay, hey, y'all just need kills on Tuscan Main Street. Wow. Nice. Come here. Where are you getting shot from? Oh, there's the bats. Let's get that. Easy maulers. Good shot, mate. You've got his head. Very good shooting. Wow. You blew his brains out. Very good shooting. Nice headshot. Very good shooting. Hey. 
There we go, we got the villa one completed now. So laggy, takes so long to shoot. Currently sitting on 300 ping. There's another contract. Good shot, mate. You've got it, 300 molars right there. Good shot, mate. Good shot, mate. Hey, you got him. Good. Oh, god damn it, bro. Couldn't find anyone. Wow. Very good shoot. Nice headshot. Hey. Got him. Nice headshot. Hey. Wow. Wow. 130 ping gaming. Very. Wow. You blew his brains out. Nice. Wow. Wow. You. I'll find anyone, come on. Good shot, mate. You've got his head. Very good shooting. Ninety-eight HP. Wow, you blew it. Nice headshot. Nice head. Nice headshot. Very good. Okay, we've just completed two contracts at the exact same time. That's never happened before to me. Wow. I don't know how we came back from that, but we defied the odds. Ooh, some four teams. And we've completed a contract of 450. Wait, have they buffed it again? Wait, no, they haven't. I thought they buffed it again there. Nice headshot. Nice headshot. Hey, you got him. Wow. Wow. You blew his breath. Nice good shot, mate. Hey, you got him. Wow, you blew his brains out. Nice. Oh, you blew his brains out. Hey, you're very good. I've got to say one HP wonder. Let's go. Let's see how much we got within about 15 minutes of playing. So we basically got about 2,200, which is insane. So yeah, it's actually not that hard to get molars. Obviously, you would have to wait for the contracts to renew and stuff. But, you know, you go outside, touch some grass in that time. And uh, yeah, that's how they get molars in this game. It's pretty simple.